Guess which Pokemon are stronger? Is it Megas or G-Maxes? I don't know. So today, we're putting it to the test. Arpus and I randomized our starter Pokemon. All of my starters will be Megas, and all of his starters will be G-Max. And after picking Pokemon for six rounds, we're going to battle to see which Pokemon are stronger. Comment which team you're on, either hashtag Team Mega or hashtag Team G-Max. All righty, Arpus, behind me are my three Mega selections. There's some amazing Mega Pokemon, but there's also some really good Gigantamax Pokemon. Yeah, there's also some really bad Mega Pokemon, too. Yeah, no, that's that's fair. There's definitely some bad ones, but I'm feeling good. I can feel my butt cheeks tingling because I can feel some good stuff behind me. Let's see what they are. Three, two, one. Oh, baby! <laughs> I mean, the cheeks were tingling for a reason, I guess. Oh, my. Yeah, this guy was tingling my booty. All right, all right. Let's not panic. Let's not get crazy. I don't think that this is an obvious choice, even though it might seem like it. Mega Charizard X looks really cool, but don't sleep on the Meta Jam. He's got pure power, which doubles his attack and is an insane ability. It's also pretty fast, too, so it just, like, does a ton of damage pretty much every turn. Yeah, so low-key, I'm, like, kind of thinking Meta Jam. Mega Ampharos? No, I'm gonna be honest now. Get, no, I don't want Mega Ampharos. Charizard X, though, I mean, it's a Charizard that's not four times weak to rock. It's, like, pretty good. But Weak to ground. I cannot pass up on the most iconic Mega in the entire game. So with that being said, I'm gonna lock in Mega Charizard X as my first Pokemon. Let's go. Well, you got yourself a powerful Mega Charizard. But may I remind oh, you? Oh yeah. Hey, don't get too excited. May I remind you? Charizard's also got a G Max form. So let's see. Well, that's true. You could get G Max Charizard. Today. Imagine G Max Charizard versus Mega Charizard. That would be really cool. <laughs> Ooh, let's see. Three, two, one. Oh, wait. I just clicked. We have Gengar. Okay. Yeah, dude. I was waiting for you to be like, oh, wait. That's actually not bad at all. I, I saw the orbital and the cake. That's pretty much all I saw at first. But G Max Gengar on the left. I mean, we got to say it, right? What? Wow. He is here. What a great G-Max. Another Pokemon that also has a Mega. With all this Mega talk, you low-key love Megas more than G-Maxes. That's what it sounds like. I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm really not feeling G-Max Alcream. Orbital is also very cool. I mean, it's a UFO. Come on, that's a sweet idea to turn a bug into a UFO. Unfortunately, it's still an Orbital and it's not the best. Yeah, it's, it's trash. You can just say it. You can admit that your G-Max Pokemon are trash. It's, it's pretty bad, but G-Max Gengar is definitely not trash, which is why I'm locking it in. I was going to do the safe thing. Probably the lame thing too, but I'm picking the G-Max Gengar. Fair enough. I would have done the same thing. Round number two, Arpus. I know it's not like who wins or loses every round, but I'm gonna okay. be honest, I think I won that round. I think I got one point on you. I think I got one point. Mega Charizard X is way cooler than stupid uh, G-Max Gengar. You say that now until you see the tongue. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Okay, Manetric's trash. Let's let's just make a wall. I'm gonna build a wall. I'm gonna build a wall. Whoa, it is not, it's not trash. No, you can't, you can't block off one of the Megas. It's not really letting me, but you guys see the vision here. Nobody wants Mega Manectric. That thing is so bad. It's actually bad. No, no. Mega Manectric is actually pretty bad. Now, Mega Manectric is literally worse than G-Max Gengar. That's how bad it is. But we still got two bangers. We got a Mega Gardevoir and a Mega Garchomp. This is actually a really tough decision. I think if this were the first round, I'd go Mega Garchomp. But because I already have a Dragon-type Pokemon, I don't think I can pass up on a Fairy-type and pick a Dragon-type over it. So you're taking the Mega Gardevoir is what you're saying. I am going to take the Mega Gardevoir. Yeah, I'm going to lock that in. It's got crazy special attack. It's going to moon blast all over your Pokemon's faces. Mega Gardevoir, welcome to the team. Well, at a pretty solid first round. I mean, come on. You've been dissing G-Max Gengar, but you can't even deny it's a good Pokemon. Time to get him some backup. A little sidekick. <sighs> I mean, I said little sidekick. I didn't mean a little dog, you know. I didn't mean a lap dog or a cat. Whatever Eevee is, okay? A dog or a cat. Leave it in the comments. What do you think, Eevee? You did get yourself a Loch Ness Monster, though. That's <laughs> yeah. that's cool. I do love G-Max Lapras because I love... It's got, like, sheet music floating around. It. A little Ooh, icicles or music. Yeah, it is, it is pretty cool. Not a bad pick at all. G-Max Eevee in the middle, which honestly is not that bad. What? It's not that Dude, bad, actually. Dude, it's awful. What are you talking about? It's not that bad. G-Max Eevee... <laughs> 
<laughs> the G-Max moves it uses are actually pretty solid. Please pick Eevee. Please pick Eevee. The problem I'm is G-Max only lasts Eevee. three turns. So after the three turns, this is just an Eevee. <laughs> so it, yeah, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Sanaconda, on the other hand. My Sanaconda don't. My Sanaconda don't. My Sanaconda don't. Come on. No, no, no. You got buns, huh? Nicki Minaj, calm down, bro. Calm Sorry. down. G-Max Sanaconda on the left. A sweet, sweet G-Max. But honestly, for me, this round, it is between Sandaconda and Lapras. Which do I want, though? That's the real question. That's the only question you can answer. Neither of them are weak to or good against the Gardevoir you just got. Right. Keep going. This is going great so far. And... Um, Lapras. Oh, but Sandaconda could help me out against Charizard. Sure. And Lapras could. So you just made that up. You just lied to everyone. I did lie, but I was trying to get in your head so that, so that you would feel like there's nothing you can do that's the correct answer, but there's right, probably well, I don't like answer. liars, so that's why I'm picking the G-Max Sandaconda. I'm gonna jump into him, dude. I'm jumping into him. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, I'm He's I'm flying spinning. away! <laughs> Arpus, I'm ripping this one quick off like a band-aid. Three, two, one, shoving! Uh, uh, quick like a band-aid. Maybe not the strat. Yeah, I. it actually turned out that it didn't... I don't have great Pokemon. I will say, these are some of the coolest, like, models. These are some of the coolest looking Pokemon that I've ever seen. Just not necessarily the strongest. Mega Agron looks crazy, that's for sure. And and camera up. I know I say this every time camera up comes up, but he's one of my favorite Pokemon, and I think his mega looks so cool. This man loves his camel. I, I do. I love my hump. camels. Unfortunately, though, he just isn't that strong. A Pokemon that is pretty strong, though, is the Heracross. I yeah, think it has one of the say. highest attack stats in the entire game. I think it has an attack of like 180 or something absolutely ridiculous like that. I hope at least he learns Mega Horn, Close Combat, and if he does, then um. Well, he's got Skill Link, so you want like arm thrust, bullet seed, oh, pin missile. Whoa, I did not know that. You're teaching me, Arpis. Okay, well, uh, that is okay. very good are to you, know. How did you not know? Okay, well. I never used him before. I don't know. He's got a big old Pinocchio nose. I should have been quiet. <laughs> I, I don't I don't normally pick people with big Pinocchio noses, but this is a rare occurrence where I'm going to have to. I'm locking in Mega Heracross as my third Pokemon. Ooh, wow, I was going to say Mega Agron. Not that strong, but it is bulky. I don't really care about thickness. You don't subscribe to that? Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm more of like, a, I need someone who can bang. I don't need someone who's thick. Oh, I get you. I get you. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. You ripped it off like a band-aid. I might have to do the same. I mean, it didn't really work out, you know? All right, try it. See if it works for you. Let's see if the strat works for me. Come on, come on, come on now. Three, two, one, boop. That's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, the silence is so loud, but it's actually not bad. No, I will take it. I love G-Max Venusaur, who we got front and center in the middle. He does look sick. It's sweet, but not only that, it's very good in battle. Do I want that? I do already have a poison type, so I got to keep that in mind. We have G-Max Duraludon, which is very, very good. And of course, g Max Colossal. Yeah. Which is a G-Max Colossal. You know, it's it, there's not much you can say about it. it. This Pokemon looks so weird. It just looks so weird. It does. It looks like he's stuck in there. Like, it doesn't look like it's him, you know? He looks like he's yeah, trapped. Yeah, you're he's right. Like, I mean, you're like, get me out! I'm dying! Slowly and painfully, someone please! Oh, yeah, the most painful death. I'm being lit on fire, please! Yeah, one drop of water and he's dead. Just saying. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. So I don't know if I really want that. It's looking like it's going to be between Venusaur and Duraludon for this round. I don't know. It would be really nice to have a steel type. It's steel and dragon, which is super unique. Huh, but is it good enough to pass on the G-Max Venusaur? Ooh, this would be pretty weak to your Charizard. And Gardevoir. I am going to take the Duraludon. Let's go, baby. Fair enough. I would have chosen the same. I'm gonna be honest, Arpus. Duraludon is the only Pokemon I'm scared of on your team. Oh, you should be, bro, because I'm gonna take you to the 55th floor and drop you down. Well, what's weird about Duraludon is low key is kind of fast, and he's literally a skyscraper that doesn't move. It doesn't make any sense to me, but whatever. I'll I'll, I'll make it work. I'll take care of him. Easy peasy, lime in. Squeezy! Whoa! Sweet mama! Ooh. 
Ooh. What a round, okay, Macy's! now. Wait, Holy you got yourself a smokes. starter. Okay. Yeah, I got a Swamper. That's sick. But I also got a legendary Latios. Latios? That is true. I think it's Latios. Latios. Okay. It's a good thing that they, like, the game designers really di differentiated so that everyone knows which one's which. They're pretty much the same Pokemon, though. Let's be honest. On the right, though, we do got an Absol, which does attain the fairy typing in its mega form, which is pretty cool. Unfortunately, though, it's trash. So... No, that, don't lie to them. <laughs> no, it's Ar Arpus. Look me in the eye. It's not fair type. Is it not? No, it's not fair type. Oh, it's not. What? It has wings. Wait, it's actually trash. I'm looking at its stats. It's so bad. No, it's no, it gets so sucker bad. punch. It's good. It's good. It's good. Sucker punch would be decent on it, but decent is not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for superb. Come I'm looking on. for legendary. No. I'm looking for epic. And uh, well, I got just that with this mega Latios. Honestly, I really yeah, wish I, I would pick you. the mega Swampert, but I just can't when there's a when there's a legendary next to it. Yeah, yeah, definitely hard to pass on the mega legendary Pokemon. I don't blame that. Oh, is that what you're picking? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna lock it in. But I really hope to get Mega Swamper in another round because I really do want him. Uh, I, it would just be really silly for me to pass up on this guy. So I'm locking in the Mega Latios. Let's go, baby. Still yet to see one of the Urshi. That is what I'm looking for. Oh, that's right. Urshi does get a G-Max. I forgot about that. Well, hopefully you never see it today. That is my chance for a legendary G-Max. I, your reaction is... Is it behind me? Oh, you don't know. You don't have an urgent food behind you. I'll just tell you right now. Is it? Is it no. Yeah, no, you don't have one. So. Three, two, one. Boop. I was really hoping you. <laughs> oh, no. Come on. Get him. Get oh, him. I hoped I spoke it into existence. But here we go. We have G Max Meowth on the right. And yeah, I, uh, I seriously have no idea why this is even a thing. We have G Max Snorlax in the middle. Who's taking a fat nap right now, but it's okay because he's got way to the world. Yeah, th I think this might be my favorite. G-Max. I mean, how cool is it that he has his own planet? It reminds me of King Kai's planet from Dragon Ball. Uh, yeah, it also would remind me of that, too, if I had seen that. That's crazy that you haven't seen Dragon Ball. L Arpus in the comments. L Arpus in the comments. That's terrible. No, no. W Arpus in the comments, because I also have G-Max Cinderace. I think this might be a favorite Pokemon. It might be. Yeah, it's definitely up there. This thing it is so cool. It might be. And I also don't have a fire type yet, so I need to consider Cinderace. I don't think Meowth is really in the question for this round, unfortunately. But that just makes it an easier choice between Cinderace and Snorlax. So I choose. He's just standing up there cross-armed. He does not care, bro. I gotta pick it, bro. Cinderace wins my vote this round. Snorlax, I'm sorry, but at least you can keep napping. Dude. It's okay. Arpus, my team is just getting better and better and better, and I have a good feeling about this round as well. Please show me another legendary mega Pokemon in three, two, one, skadoosh. Oh, baby! Well, not legendary, but, uh... Pseudo. Pretty gosh dang Pseudo close. Pretty sure. gosh dang close. In fact, I would even argue that Mega Metagross is stronger than a lot of other Mega Legendary Pokemon. Might be on something. It's definitely better than the Latios you just picked. You know what the best part is too? Is I don't even have a Steel type on my team. So it not only is it insanely strong and one of the best Megas, but it also fits perfectly. Aldino, I'm not even gonna make any jokes about this thing. Does it though? You just, you have, this will be your third Psychic type Pokemon if you choose Metagross. I'm gonna choose Metagross. You're gonna have three. Three psychic types when I have a G Max Gengar. I will be in your head the entire battle. I'll be mind reading everything. I'll be using telepathy, and you'll be in a world of trouble. I think my ghost type, my ghost type will be in your head. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna hit you with the craziest Genjutsus that you've ever seen. My Gengar is gonna have the craziest Genjutsu. He didn't watch Naruto either, guys. Come on. He's gonna do he's gonna do jujitsu, bro. Comment L Arpus for not watching Dragon Ball or Naruto. Bro, say that right now. I leaked the whole hidden village app. <laughs> or whatever it's called. He doesn't even you can't leak it if you don't know it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm locking in Mega Metagross. Let's go, baby. That's gonna be sick. All right, got a pretty solid Pokemon. I'll, I'll drop the act. I won't lie to you. Arpus, you're about to get a solid Pokemon. I will drop the act. And I will, I will give it to, it's a really easy choice too. So let's okay, we can, let's well, just move quickly through this one. I don't want. I, we don't have to spend too much time here. I'll take your word for it then. All right, all right. Let me turn around right now and say what we got. We don't have to talk about it. We don't. We really don't have to talk about this one. Finally, Urshifu on the left. We have the bearded crab, G Max Kingler in the middle. I mean, this Pokemon is the goat. If Urshifu wasn't next to it... Oh, pick him. Oh, pick him. Oh, wait, he's the goat, Arpus. You should pick him. He's the goat. Let me let me finish my sentence, bro. If Urshifu wasn't right next to it, I probably wouldn't make it. 
I'm not gonna lie. But in the right slot is a G Max Flapple Appleton. I don't know which one it is, but either way, not picking it. I'm going with Urshifu. Just give it to me. Gosh dang it, this is bad. Just give me the Urshifu, bro. That's like the worst thing that you could have gotten for me. Oh, Arpish! Oh. Welcome to the final. Oh yeah, that sounds good. That's I knew it, dude. A little tingly in my fingerlies, and uh, some spicy's behind me. I know it. I know it. Let me see what it is. There, dude. There might be something flaming hot. Yeah, bro. Dabba, dude, <laughs> that is what I'm talking about. Are you kidding? Dude, this is like, this is insane. Primal Groudon. Give me something to talk about. Wait, why do I get like the three best ones on the last round? That is actually kind of annoying because I would have loved the Tyranitar on my team as well. And I also would have loved a Lucaro on my team as well, but I didn't, I didn't get them. And I'm still never going to get them because obviously I have to pick the Primal Groudon. Oh, the you, only you thing though to? is that I have a lot of psychics on my team. And so I would have really liked the dark type Pokemon with the T-Tar. But Ooh. as much as I want T-Tar, as much as he works on my team. You're just I, taking the bait on it. You're just going for the big one. I'm just taking the big one every single turn. I don't care if it works or if it doesn't work. I am going to take the Primal Groudon, and he is going to press the price blades every single one of your Pokemon to oblivion. Yeah, okay. Your team will be on the precipice. I'll tell you that, bro. I don't even know what that means, but okay. Be honest, man. My team's good. My I am fully confident. I don't even need this last Pokemon. This last Pokemon is just extra credit for me. It's definitely extra zesty. I'll tell you that right now. Zesty? Oh, okay, okay. So, behind me, there has to be a grim snarl mm -hmm. or maybe hatterene hatterene no too. no when you'll see it you'll be like oh yeah that is okay let's see i'll see all right you got the zest king and queen behind you and then you got adam let's see Boom. Ooh, is Adam the Copperaja? Yeah, the giant nose. I feel like I am also Copperaja. Do you have a big nose? No, it's not that big, but it's like, it's it's not it's not small. It's a good nose, though. It's good shape. Perfect. So how is that Copperaja? This dude's got a giant nose. On the right, we have, is this, this is this the king or the queen? That is whatever you want it to be. The zesty king himself, Rim Snarl. I mean, just look at those legs, bro. That looks amazing. I know. It's like Mel Metal wanted to show off his legs. The Grim Snarl said, psych, dude, look at mine. Check out these thunder thighs. Yes, yeah, psych, bro. Look at mine. G Max Mel Metal in the uh, middle, and then G Max Copperage on. I will say, knowing you have three psychic types, all of these Pokemon are good. No, they're not. Arpus, don't, you don't have to say that. All of them are good. Two steel types and a dark type, I mean. But I really don't see a reason to pick Copperage. There's no reason to pick this Pokemon. Melmetal is in the middle, so we're picking that. I'm taking G Max Melmetal as my final Pokemon. I'm locking it in. Give it to me. That is no problem. I can take care of that. No problem at all. Zero problems whatsoever. Melmetal is easy, easy work. Well, I guess we'll see, because it's time. Duke it out. Yeah, let's go dookie together. Let's see who can dookie harder than the other. And here we go. We have Ooh. a Mega Gardevoir versus a G Max in to kick things off. Really not the best matchup for me, if I'm being yeah, honest. With I you. mean, it's a pretty neutral matchup. I'm just a little faster, so I will attack first. Let's see what oh, you got for the you big are so big. fireball. We are giant. Oh, 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 oh. That's not good. That is really. Mega Gardevoir not goes down in one good. shot. That's really not good at all. Let's go for this. See what this does. Now you probably understand why Cinderace is my favorite Pokemon. Look how cool he is, dude. That is so sick. I mean, it's so great. And it feels even better to destroy you with it. You see that? I got a speed boost and an attack. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But all good things oh. do come to an end, Arpus, unfortunately. That is the unfortunate part. <laughs> but I do have double Double edge. Edge. Dude, wait. Charizard's low-key tanky, bro. This I can't is, believe he yeah, tanked all those oh hits. Oh, my gosh. He lived forever. That was crazy. Now this gets tough. Okay. Um, Who do I want to go in with? I think you should send out your Mel Metal. If you're if you're asking everyone like in the area, I would say Mel Metal. The Mel Metal. Okay, I'll do just that. Psych. That's not Mel Metal. I'm bringing out the Gengar. Please outspeed somehow, Charizard. Darn it. Okay. Let's go. All right, there we go. How I destroy this guy is very simple and easy. Bro, he's licking my butt. Yo, now I see why you picked him, bro. What the? Yo, what? That's crazy. Oh. Primal. Yeah, I had to bring him out and I had to bring him out early. I was hoping to save this guy for later, but I'm gonna be honest, there's not much I can do against the Gengar, so. Yeah, I hope I have. I'm gonna have to start precipicing all over you right now. Precipicing. Oh no. <laughs> 
That's real funny, dude. Real mature of you to do that. Destiny bonds. Cool, bro. Cool. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, here we go. Sandaconda. This guy is cheesing me. Are you serious? Are you actually serious right now? There's no cheese. There's no cheese at all. You, you, uh, you double minimize. I didn't even know that we were doing evasion. We never do evasion. And you're coiling. Oh my god, pin missile. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Wait. Oh! Wait, no! Whoa! <laughs> Oh my gosh! That you deserve that. What? You deserve that for all the cheese. That is insane. Bro, I can't. How? I did deserve that, but how did that kill through the coil too? Through the coil, through the minimize, through the para. Santa Conda is so bad. Oh my gosh! Heracross is him. All right, here we go, man. This makes it tough because my last three Pokemon are kind of weak to you. Oh. Well, I'm extremely slow now that I'm paralyzed, so I can't imagine this is going to be too difficult. For you to get through. That is true. That is true. Boom, baby! Oh my, wait, Heracross is no, no, in. No, that was part of the plan. That was part of the plan. You don't understand. You really don't understand because now you're at least a little weaker. Yeah, I did close combat, so my defenses are lowered as well. What? Close combat does nothing. Pin missile, pin missile, pin missile. Wait, no, don't be parried. No, I'm oh. dead. I'm dead. I'm oh. so dead. Oh, oh so weak, mama! Heracross is in! Mel Metal, I need you to come through, buddy. Oh my gosh, what do I even go for here? Wow, this is actually crazy. Oh, I did not know Heracross was like that. Mel Metal, I need you to put on for the team. Mel Metal versus Meta Gross. I need you to put on. This is a fun matchup here. Hammer Arm. Oh, Hammer Arm, no. All right, I need, I need this working with me. You need me to get full parrot here, I think. I know, I need you to get fully parrot like three times in a row. Oh, wow, that is like nothing. Come on. Ah! Okay. Mm, there's one. Okay. There's one. No, Arpus. No, not like this. Not like this. Come on. Let's just get one more. Let's get one more at least. Let's get one more. Please hit through. Please hit through. Please hit through. Boom. Boom, oh, baby. Oh, Let's oh. go and mega Pokemon take the victory, Roy Al. G G's. Mega Pokemon are victorious. They deserve it. They deserve it. GG. If you guys enjoyed that video, make sure to leave a like and click right here for some more awesome Pixelmon videos.